Hello, my darlings. My name is Victoria, and this is Veritas Tarot. I'm going to do your daily mini reading for you. I'm using my lovely uh, Soul Flower Plant Spirit Oracle. It's a new deck for me. It's really gorgeous. Uh, and we're going to see what messages, what message spirit has for you today, my darling. Um, and uh, if it resonates, as you know, your soul is simply remembering what it already knows. Um, and if it doesn't resonate, it simply means the message wasn't for you at this time. There's always a message out there for you at exactly the right time as guided by spirit. Um, just a quick announcement. I put out uh, a notification today on the community group for my subscribers that I'm doing a subscriber special offer. So if you'd like to book a reading uh, during between now and the end of August, uh, you can take advantage of the book one and get one half price reading. So you can either choose to have both of those readings for yourself and, and, and pick the second reading at a late, later date when you have the first reading with me, we'll choose a date for you to do the second one, or you can give it away as a gift to somebody, or you can say to me, I've booked the first one, but I'd like to add on the second and have it as an hour reading. But that's book one reading and get another one half price. The details are in the description box below, my darling, if you wish to take that, that offer. So let's move ahead with the reading reading and let's see what wants to come out for you thank you spirit i'm just going to do one one card tonight for you okay so what have we got we've got hawthorne courage how beautiful is that so let's put that card there and pick up those ones that were on the bottom and let me show you this card this is hawthorne courage beautiful word courage isn't it what does it say on the card hawthorne is a medicine for the heart on all levels, helping you find the courage to face and overcome your fears and facilitating self-love and self-acceptance. Hawthorne supports a strong and protected open-hearted state, allowing you to fully give and receive love so that you can truly come into your own divine strength and power. Beautiful message there. So what I'm picking up with this is that courage comes in many forms doesn't it and and it can come and i'm feeling with this because it is to do with the heart that courage is coming in the form in, of strength in the face of for many of you uh, maybe pain and and grief that you're feeling at this time and spirit wants you to have an open courageous heart continue to look for the good in everything in spite of the situation continue to love the world in spite of where you are right now. You see, because I'm getting the words valiant courage, it takes great valiant courage like a knight to move forward in the face of your fears. And actually, unless we had the fear, we couldn't be courageous, could we? We wouldn't know one without the other. So that's a beautiful example of the duality that is always present in our lives and the necessary interdependence of relationships with things because how could we get to know that we were being brave and courageous and valiant unless we felt fearful at the same time and you know it's a choice it's a choice so let me just move that back so you can see it it's a choice to be courageous isn't it it's a choice because in being courageous although you're being afraid you're actually still doing something so um if there is no fear as i said there is just no courage and uh, who was it who said um it's a writer somebody might tell me um is it i can't it'll come back to me but it's something about grace under pressure isn't it that's something that's very very courageous and having grace under pressure is acting courageously and doing it therefore because you're being led by the heart space you're doing it uh with a grace you're doing it with a beauty as well um and in acting um with that grace under pressure and acting courageously you are acting authentically you are acting you are following your inner voice you're following your soul because when you feel it in your heart you're listening to source wisdom and only good things can come from following the heart um it's 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 another beautiful way you know how we talk about or i talk about and, and messages about following our intuition following that knowing following that heart space within you and that's why it's very important to be courageous and you know it's it's about um 
what calls us to do the right thing. And, and as I said, being courageous has um, many different faces to it. It, it. it might mean that you're going to uh, contact somebody to say that you were sorry for something that you did. It might be in stepping out of your comfort zone, uh, even though you fear you may might miss miss up. It might be going to get that test, you know, or that procedure that you haven't wanted to do for a very long time. It might simply be for asking from help from somebody. There are so many different um, uh, faces of courage, you know, and 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 all of this. It's about the trust in ourselves that we feel this is the right thing to do however much it might fill us with fear we feel it is the right thing to do and with all of it to wake up each day and choosing to be love choosing to be bless the world choosing uh to look for the good in everything um and it's that is when we choose to do this, we're setting an intention and setting an intention is a very empowering thing to do because we're making a choice in setting the attention. We are making a choice to take responsibility for ourselves. And, you know, we're all human. OK, we're all human beings and we're going to fall short of it. Of course we are. Um, we do it all the time, but it is then choosing to understand that we may not quite have the energy today to be that courageous but actually it still is our intent and 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 that momentum carries us forward and it's sometimes allowing others to be the courageous ones for us and being able to receive that as well so um i feel this is the main message for you at this time that if you recognize that you are fearful um but you still wish to move through it courageously. You can't go far wrong, darling, because when you take that inspired action, you take that valiant courage to make that momentum, to make that, um, how do I say this, movement forward, you are allowing in that space, because you are listening to source energy, you're allowing source energy to move through you and to move out into the world. And we are simply, love that is who we are uh we are not really our personalities we're not really our identities we think we are but we're not we're actually source energy and source energy is love and so in experiencing that in in being that valiant courage that night moving through moving onwards not knowing what you're going to face but doing it anyway you will feel that love within you you'll feel that unconditional love you'll feel that connection to source energy because you'll feel it's that extraordinary feeling we've all done it when we've been courageous about something it feels amazing doesn't it and it gets us to know who we truly are and how brave and how courageous we we can be when we set our mind to it so i hope uh, that has helped and resonated uh, with those that has come to this reading tonight. I, I'm, I'm loving these cards. I'm going to show that to you again. Soul flower, plant spirit oracle. They are just a beautiful deck of cards. Um, and I will be doing more of those for the daily readings for you in the future. But in the meantime, have a lovely evening and I look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Take care, my darlings. Bye bye.